<laughs> Zombie media. Congrats to the brick and jingle bit. Awesome. Thank you. That was, uh, that was a fun ceremony yesterday and uh, just glad to be a part of it. it was fun. Uh, every year we've been around, we've seen you grow more mature and demanding. You got a little uh, face hair now. Uh, commanding the room. How, how's it changed for you as, as you keep going through this? I think I'm just more comfortable with everyone. I think uh, the years that I've had here, uh, I've grown with the guys and they've grown with me and, and we're comfortable with each other and I know that I can go to them for anything and come from, they can come to me for anything. It was a successful trip up here to Jesuit last year. I know you know, Eugene kid, but it's mm -hmm. good to move this thing around in, in camp and kind of mix it up. Yeah, it's it's fun. It's it's uh, we're not always going to play at home, and so this is, it's good practice for us to, to get out to a different atmosphere and, and uh, play a little football. So it's, it's fun. Did Sheldon ever play at the old Franklin before? Uh, no, we never got to play there. Okay. What Did, do you think about this, man? This is uh, this is an impressive facility. This is really nice. So it's uh, it's a pleasure to play here. So we're looking forward to. It. How does it feel going into this next year? Do you guys have goals that you're setting for yourself and maybe for the team that weren't there last year? Yeah, I think uh, with all the guys we're bringing back, I think we just got to keep taking steps forward. Um, I'm really confident with the guys that we have, the receivers, offensive linemen, running backs, and, and uh, you know, I've, I know that we've got great guys around us. So uh, just keep taking steps forward and, and listen to our coaches and things to take care of the rest. How has that message been from Mario? He obviously was around last year, but mm -hmm. you know, now that it's, it's his show. Yeah, he's he's a guy that that everyone looks to. He's he's our leader, and and uh, he's a guy that everyone is bought into. And, and uh, whatever he says, you know, we follow and, and we, we trust him 100. percent Because we're not really sure he said he would want you the most. Did he really say that? <laughs> yeah, he did. Yeah, I believe that. Um, I think uh, hopefully that he's not hitting me today. So you know, luckily I think I'm gonna get away with it. But. You still gonna rock the uh, touchdown tackle drills too this year? Um, we'll see. We'll see about that. Um, some of the coaches have told me to kind of take it easy on that, so uh, we'll see how it goes. How has uh, Del Dylan Mitchell's development been and has kind of becoming the, the number one guy for you guys? Yeah, I mean, he was really good when he when he first got here, but he's he's gotten even better. He's he's a guy that just has to slow down. He's, he's getting better every single day and, and a guy that I, I trust completely. So um, I know that the game's on the line. I'll throw him the ball and, and he'll, he'll, get, he'll come up with it. Last year you played really, really well. This year, what is it you want to grow on or change or make do better than maybe what you did mm -hmm. last year? What's your goal? Uh, consistency. I think uh, there were times that last year we didn't we didn't play as as consistent as we could have. I think we had some really high highs and, and some low lows. And so uh, I think one of the most important things is, is figuring out the the happy medium and figuring out where where we where we lie and, and just taking care of business. Thank you, man. Thank you. Thanks, yeah. man.